This sounds straight out of a movie, but it actually happened. In 1926, the world-famous jazz pianist Fats Waller was returning home after a successful performance in Chicago when he was suddenly ambushed by a group of gangsters. Holding him at gunpoint, they told him to get into their limousine or else. And terrified for his life, Fats had no choice but to follow their orders. After a short drive, they arrived to an exclusive club. Fats, who was still shaking with fear, was forced to walk inside where he saw a gorgeous venue full of people laughing and dancing. But before he could process what exactly he was doing at this extravagant party, his kidnappers told him to go play the piano for them. And after finishing a piece still entirely confused, Fat suddenly saw the unmistakable face of Al Capone applauding in the back. Turns out, that party was actually for the violent crime boss's 28th birthday. And since Al had always been a big fan of Fats, his men had wanted to surprise him by having the famous musician perform at his party. Surprisingly, Fats was actually treated incredibly well. He was allowed to have as much of the most expensive food and champagne that he liked, and was paid $100 for each piece that he played. In the end, he spent three entire days partying with Al Capone, leaving several thousand dollars richer. 